Today, Nadine Baggett promised <sighs> to help you decide which new beauty gadgets deserve a place in your home, and she is here now. I love I it. I cannot wait for you to take us through this, Nadine. The minute we knew Rylan was in this week, we had to have beauty I on love Monday. It. I right. absolutely love it. What have we got? We have got weird, wacky, but wonderful gadgets that are worth putting on your Christmas list. Right. And we're going to start with microneedling. Now, I would say, Rylan, are you new to microneedling? I've heard so much about it, but I don't know really what it is. It is the hottest thing in beauty right now. Rylan's been doing it secretly for years, obviously. Is that why you're so handsome? <laughs> <laughs> what it is, is it is a little roller here, and this is a really great, reasonably priced high street one, and that is 0.25 mil of tiny little metal, and they basically roll over your skin. They cause micro channels for your skincare to get in. Deeper than 0.25, and you can go up to 1 and 1.5, they will actually damage the skin so that the skin produces more collagen, more elastin. A quick aside, though, can I just say, that's a really reasonably priced one. You have to keep them clean. Yes. Please buy some alcohol to right. soak them in, obviously, because you're breaking the surface of the skin. And I was talking to Georgina earlier on before the cookery item. If you've got a skin prone to pigmentation, avoid them, because they will boost pigmentation oh, in the skin. Oh, I'm really freckly, so... Right, when not when you. should you use them, though? At night, just with a hyaluronic acid, I'd so say. So, no, nothing else, just hyaluronic no, acid? No, you don't want to put a vitamin C or a retinol or something like that because they're not formulated to go deep into the skin so and that will use take that your product deep into your skin. use that a bit of hyaluronic and you'll be good. Brilliant for little superficial marks, acne marks, yeah. pop marks, anything like that, in large pores, but go gently. And a lot go of the big gently. brands are doing these now. They are, they are. Even our Trini. Trini's got one out. I have, I have one a out. feeling, though, that there is going to be a bit of backlash against them because you, you have to be careful. If your skin is remotely sensitive, if you've got current breakouts, you can spend, spread the bacteria around. And as I said, if you're either a woman of colour, and that could be anybody, from somebody who's Greek right the way through to the darkest skin tone, they can encourage pigmentation. Be so careful. be careful. Does be it careful. hurt? Uh, no, look, this is brand new out of the packaging. Okay. Now, this is only right. 0.25 mil. Oh, right, OK, yeah, yeah. But I would imagine the gadget that Rylan used. I've had a 1.5 more... every now and again, if you don't mind. <laughs> yep. Deeper. Got better and swords. Once you get up to 1.5 and 2 mil, then you do need numbing cream in yeah. clinic. Okay. Okay. Definitely. Now, you have an amazing makeup artist, but if you're I no know. good I at know. a winged eyeliner, how about these little gadgets from Is that what that is? You basically put it under like that, you put your eyeshadow on oh. and your liner, and you just follow the line. Do you know what I thought that was? The spatula from an IMAC cream. Nope. It's not going on your bits, it's going on your eyes. Fine. Yeah? OK, so you take that away. There's a little one there as well for under the eyes, different shapes. They're all designed for different eyeliner and different cut creases. They're handy, then. They are really handy if you've got no makeup skills, which is most of us, let's be honest <laughs> here. However, what did you think this was earlier on? I thought this was tape you use on your body and what I use like on my shirts and belt. But it's not. It's designed to be cut into place, to go underneath, and again, you put your eyeshadow on, you put your Shadow liner line. on, you pull it off, you get a really, really oh. neat crease and no eyeshadow underneath. That is literally a couple of pounds. A brilliant stocking filler from Revolution. That's a really Amazing. good idea, that one. Now, what about excess oh. body hair or face hair? I thought that was um, a hand exerciser. Yep, no, it's oh. not. It's the Tweezerman and it's a facial hair removal gadget. And what you do is you basically put it over whatever area you want, you screw it back up and you can feel it tighten and then you oh. pull it back up and it pulls the hair out. That's that. a good little you gadget. You do not need oh, that, do. Josie. I, do from my I feel like I'm beginning to become almost too good at these items and I'm selling <laughs> everything to you guys and you don't need it. You well, really we'll take don't. it. That's where it's for. It's for a little... The whiskers. And also the super fine hair around it's here. It's good for that. Which a lot of women get. And even some, some ladies, even if they've had, like, laser arms. and stuff like that on their arms a little... That's super fine, what I would call... What we used but to call... baby hairs. But bum fluff. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. when we were younger. Yeah. And I've got a lot of it. Blondes get a lot of it under mm. here, right? That's that's a nice little thing, though. OK, uh, now, you know LED gadgets work for firming, lifting the skin, but did you know that they can work for your acne? This is a brand-new product from Face Gym, Is right? it blue? OK, and it... I love that you already know... Is it blue LED? Blue LED, and then what you do is you stick it over your breakout and you leave it in place. Home. Yeah. Now, I've That's just turned genius. it off while I stick it in place. LED is so underrated. So many more people should be using LED. Red is for like the firming and the plumping up and stuff like that. But if you, and if you do the break blue. out, there that's you go. it. Blue LED. There's the blue for breakouts. And also, can I just say, it's supposed to work quite well for cold sores as yeah. well. Yeah. They're oh. really, things like that are really, really good. And that one, how much is that one? Is that, that quite reasonable? The Face Gym one is not going to be cheap. It's £60. But can I say, 
coming over from America are little suction cut ones that just go over individual breakouts. Yeah, no, that's lovely. I've just no. got into LED lighting, you but I, I like wearing it on a night. It's like having a little disco in bed. Yeah. <laughs> Don't even need any mates. Yeah. <laughs> Never mind that if it works as long as you're having fun. That's not what you're doing. I've got two gua sha's here. Now, gua sha is a Chinese technique of using a stone to massage your face to get rid of lymphatic drainage. But let's make it 21st century, shall Please we? Do. Let's la add in, can I just say, an LED light. Love. Let's add in some. Ultrasonic. Ultrasonic, you see? You know everything. And this is the thing That's I was... So and so the advantage of this is it goes up and over your face. Yes, it works, obviously, to boost your lymphatic drainage, but the addition of the LED light, and then this one also gets hot and cold, oh. will get rid of puffiness under your eyes. Now, this is a lot of That's money. That's going to be pricey, though. Well, I would like that before I put my makeup on. So it That's what better. it's for. And a right. lot of makeup artists use them for that very reason. Now, if I fill one? this, If I put this down... It's, oh, going to make a, it's going to make a lot of noise, so let me just turn it off. Now, that is the uh, Cloud9 one. It's £129. This is a little one you can get from Amazon if you just want the massage. This is the Five Fill electric gua sha. This is £26.90. So that's like a little portable one you can take it's about with Just a little with, yeah. portable one. Also, if you sleep on your side and you get the old lady creases, how about these? This what are is, they? This is Bloom Body. These are silicon masks that you sleep in <gasps> overnight. Is it a face mask for your chest? It's for a chest. And that's exactly what it is. Stop it. Now, sorry if, if this muffles my mic. Go on. You basically put it on there. You sleep, it hydrates the skin and it stops you getting the sideways boob crease. And you get no crepiness. No crepiness. And you know, this company does them for under the eyes, they do them for the forehead here in place of Botox. Genius. That's going to sell out, I'm telling and you. And I'm going to finish with the Hello Clean, which I was holding earlier on. Here it is. You apply this to any of your shower attachments, it's a universal head, and it's like a filter. It takes out all of the hard water, so it's better for your skin and hair. And the Dragon's Den winner created that. Oh, we are. How clever is that? It's nice, that. I oh, love it. Looks lovely. I love it. I, know, I feel like... What do you want? Need, you, she wants them all. I would like that. Oh, and I'd like, well, yeah, right. right. We'll go have these. Um, um, thank you. Now. My pleasure. So My pleasure. Much. Thank, thank you. you so much. You're amazing. Day. You're amazing. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, now, if you'd like to get your hands, like Roland, on anything you've seen today, please download our free This Morning app and click on Shop to Share.